Okay friends, today I'm going to get finished up on my self-portrait. To start, I'm going to grab some oil pastels and I'm going to draw some lines radiating out from my self-portrait. I used a warm color in my background, so I'm going to use some warm color pastels like red. And I'm just going to draw some red lines, almost like lines coming off the sun. So as I get up into the corner, my lines are going to start to curve. So I've got some red lines. Now I'm going to pick another warm color. I'm going to go with yellow. I'm just going to fill in some of these spaces. When I get to the corners, my lines curve. So it almost looks like a sun. And then I'm going to add one more line. I'm going to use my last warm color, orange. I'm going to fill in all the little spaces. Okay, now I've got some beautiful radiating lines coming off my portrait. Next, I'm going to add a shirt. So I'm going to take one of these lovely little pieces of painted paper. And all I'm going to do is take the edges and draw a curved line. If you want, you can even take a pastel and draw that line. So it's going to be a little curved line like this. Little curved line like that. And then take my scissors and snip. And snip. Then that's going to be my shirt and it's going to go right here. If you want to be really fancy, you could maybe draw a curved line and cut it out here. Or you could even make a little slit like that. See how it's cut and then I can fold over the edges so it looks like I'm wearing a collar. So you can make your shirt however you want. Once you've made your shirt, we are going to go ahead and glue it down. When I glue, it's, say it with me friends, dip, dip, wipe it on the lip, dot, dot, not a lot. Do I put glue in the middle? Nope, I only put glue on the edges. Then I glue it down and I can just press and hold and count to 10. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Voila, masterpiece complete. Have fun, amazing artist.